Little Geeks, Little Boss. Bob we've got now with Mini Body and tell everybody welcome back to another Little Geeks Little Boss video. Today's video comes from our mom and dad, but Hasbro makes it. And also a big shout out to our friend Khalil, because if it weren't for him, we wouldn't have this because he got it at one of the stores that he went to. And remember you can visit Khalil at socials at Caster's Corner. That's Caster's with a K and Corner with a K. So thanks again, Khalil, for hooking us up. And let's see what we got in the box today. So magic map. <gasps> well, check it out, everybody. We got Alita 1. This is part of the Transformers Netflix series. And remember to go check that out on Netflix now. We started watching it a couple of days ago. And this is phrases 8 and up. And it's available now for $19.99. As you can see on the side of the Netflix boxes, the art is all red, black, and white. And... This looks really cool and really accurate to the show because Alita 1 is in the show. It looks pretty good in the box. Let's check it out outside of the box. So open. open. All right, everybody, we got her out of the box. The joints on her legs are pretty loose, though. Other than that, she looks like a pretty G1 accurate bot and Netflix show accurate bot. We got a piece of the Teletron 1 in here and the instructions. I think, let's see how many steps she transforms in. She transforms in five steps. All right, so when you open her up, be careful that you see your gun because it's clear in the clear um, plastic. She has really big feet and the gun fits perfectly in her hand. It also has this on the side. So I think you can, when she gets transformed, you can slide it into here somewhere. And just like RC, she has this backpack that can come off and it's like a surfboard. My bad, she doesn't transform in five steps. She transforms in 15 steps. And we have her on the her surfboard. It's really just her backpack on the side. It's pretty cool though. Now it's time to check her out in alt mode. Alt mode, alt mode. All right, so we got her transformed. She looks really G1 Netflix accurate, but with our seed, we had a perfect time, but they, I think this is the first time we had a bit of trouble transforming a bot because the legs wouldn't go all the way in, so, and we think there's like something stopping it. But anyway, other than that, it looks like a good bot. Let's look at her in comparison to our seed. So as you can see, really the only difference in between these two bots is this on our seed. But as you can see, all around they're the same box, just different colors. Actually, never mind, my dad just realized that this piece was still in the box. So that's why you always had to check your boxes before you throw them out. So they're, now they're just the same, different colors. Even from the back, you can see their legs have the same position to transform in the front. I think RC had a bit more detail than this one, but that's okay. Let's check this Alita one next to the plain Alita one. So this is, I think, the Combiner Wars Alita one. So this one's a plane, this is a car, and this one's a bit bigger because this is the body of a combiner. And last but not least, let's check them all together in bot mode. Bot mode, bot mode. All right, everybody, we got them all into bot mode. And as you can see, these two Alita ones pretty much look the same. This one's just a bit bigger. And this RC really only has a different head. And other than that, they're the same bots. Actually, they have different chests. I love all three, but remember we're here to talk about this Alita one, and she's available now for $19.99 for ages eight and up. Thank you again, Cleo, for picking this up for us to review. Thank you, Mom and Dad, for getting this for us from Cleo to review. <laughs> and thank you, everybody, for watching our Little Geeks Little Bots video till all are one. Notes on Little Geeks for more toys and more fun. Please like our video and subscribe for our YouTube channel.